So Pagan Min from Far Cry 4 is definitely one of the more famous and more known antagonists from the Far Cry series. You know, he rules the fictional Himalayan country of Kirat and there's also no doubt about that he was probably one of the best antagonists from the Far Cry series, maybe next to Vaz. But now after I've completed and even reviewed Far Cry 4, I had a very interesting way of thinking because I believe that Pagan Min was actually the good guy in Far Cry 4 and I'm gonna tell you why I think that way. So firstly we gotta say that Pagan Min is really portrayed as a very charismatic and charming character. You know his interactions with RJ Gale are really engaging and intriguing. And the more you interact with him and the more you talk to him, you realize that he's a very intelligent person, even though one wouldn't think that way in the first place. And the more you play the game and the more you know about Pagan Min, you realize his depth of character. You know, throughout the game, we players learn about his motivations, about his history and relationships that reveal some layers that kind of make him human, you know, beyond that typical evil villain archetype that we see in many other video games. And moreover, Pagan Min is actually the stepdad of Ajay Gale, you know, he had a relationship with his mother, so you know, that connection to Ajay's family really adds even more complexity to his character. But now probably one of the biggest parts why I think that Pagan Min is actually the good guy in the game is not because of him particularly, it's more because of the flaws of the Golden Path. You know, the Golden Path, the rebel group fighting against Pagan Min, is definitely not without its own issues. You know, firstly, the faction is split between itself. You know, on one hand you have Amita and on the other hand you have Sabal. And you know, those two are two leaders with very different approaches. And particularly after finishing the game and siding with either Amita or Sabal, you realize that those two are more crazy than Pagan Min. I mean, firstly, RJ defeated Pagan Min, the guy that they have been fighting for years, and they immediately treat him like trash and like he hasn't done anything for them. And so, you know, if you choose a meter, the country will kind of become a drug cartel. However, if you choose Sabal, the country kind of becomes a terrorist group. And, you know, here we have to say that Pagan Min definitely didn't govern Kirat with a good approach. You know, there was still a lot of violence and the methods that he ruled Kirat with definitely were not great. However, after finishing the game, I realized that his methods may have been brutal, but you might see his rule as a necessary evil to prevent even more chaos. And in the end it becomes clear that Pagamin even wanted Ajay Gale to be his successor and actually didn't have any evil plans with him whatsoever. And when the game was coming to an end I really thought to myself, why didn't the game actually give us the chance to side with Pagan Min and fight against Amita and Sabal, because in my eyes those two are more the bad guys than Pagan Min is. And I think Kirat was definitely in a better state while Pagan Min was ruling in the beginning and in the middle of the game than after we finish the game and the Golden Path, particularly Amita or Sabal, become the ruler. And so you know it's very important to note here that the interpretation of Pagan Min and of the whole topic is very personal and is greatly based on your own personal experiences and perspectives. However, in my eyes, after finishing Far Cry 4 and seeing the two endings that you can have, I really think that Pagan Min is actually a better choice for Kirat than Sabal or Amita and the Golden Path are. And you know, in my review I already talked a little bit about that, but I wanted to make a singular video about the topic because it really made me think quite a lot and I have to take my hats off to Ubisoft for such a turn of events. And now I want to ask you guys what you think about Pagan Min. Like, do you also believe that he was the better choice for Kirat? Or do you actually think that the Golden Path will make a better job? Alright guys, that was it for me in today's video. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.